Just about any soup is welcome in the winter, but there are few that are as warming as the beet and cabbage soup known as borscht. This recipe for Ukrainian red borscht soup is submitted by All Recipes member Patty, who says, my friend's mother from the Ukraine taught me this. First, place a large skillet over medium-high heat and crumble in one pound of bulk pork sausage. Cook the sausage, stirring often, until it's no longer pink. Then set it aside off the heat. Now, fill a large pot with about two quarts of water and bring it to a boil. Add the sausage and bring the water back to a boil. Next, add three medium peeled and shredded beets. Cook until the beets are tender and release their color into the soup, about 10 minutes. Now add three peeled and shredded carrots. And three peeled and cubed baking potatoes, such as russets. Continue to cook until both are tender, about 15 minutes more. Next, add half a medium head of cabbage that you've cored and shredded. Then, add an eight ounce drained can of diced tomatoes. Cover the pot. While the soup simmers, heat a tablespoon of vegetable oil in a skillet over medium heat and cook a chopped medium yellow onion until it softens, about five minutes. Then add a six ounce can of tomato paste. Brown it quickly to release its maximum flavor. Now add three quarters of a cup of water and stir to blend everything together. Pour this mixture into the soup pot. Finally, add three minced cloves of garlic to the soup and stir everything together. Cover the pot and turn off the heat. Let the soup stand for five more minutes so the garlic can cook in the heat of the soup. Season the soup to taste with salt and pepper and a little sugar if you like. Many All Recipes members feel it doesn't need it, depending on how sweet your beets and carrots are. Ladle the soup into serving bowls and garnish it with sour cream and chopped fresh parsley or dill. Many All Recipes members insist that fresh dill is an important garnish for authentic borscht. And as one member, A.E. Grev notes, it's practically a sin to eat borscht without the sour cream, so load it on.